Okay, so this is what happens if you're a really annoying guy and also don't be toxic. Or if this might happen to you. Let's just go while you're eating your delicious popcorn, watching this video. Slash watching this video, I mean. Yeah, that was a scene I really think some of the things that are happening. In fact, what was going through my mind at this moment? Oh, oh crap, I missed. Uh, you didn't see anything. Okay, anyways. Go get some popcorn. Go get a snack or something. This video is short. But you should be the C. Why you should not be a jerk in Gold Stars. And this is just me. So satisfying to most of you guys. Anyways, this time, I think she's got it. She, this time, I think she's got it all covered. So little do they know that this is all my time. I'm just trying to get them for my super. That's why I use that gadget there. And if you didn't notice, my super charge so my wait, wait, see? And I respawn my super. Oh wow, I never actually noticed this part of the map. It goes so deep. Anyway, this is where this tower starts to BM and be really annoying. I kick the ball out of her freaking hands because you can just go die. You can just go suck, die. And then she tries BMing by standing still instead of just walking and trying to score. I obviously spin on her. He obviously sees that because she's still in a respawn screen. And later in the round, she got even more toxic. And look at her. She's in the corner. Because she could have failed. She could have done something. And they weren't even shooting at me. I was like right up in their face. They could have done something about me, but no. Okay, here I tried. I literally pressed. I literally let like, go to the super button like one other second. Yeah, I was really angry this around about that because it actually could have helped us so much as in run. So we still win because this tower is just stupid. Anyways, I don't know how I didn't break a wall there. I mean, we we'll literally went through the wall if any of you saw. Anyways, here, this Carl tries to kill this Pam. He obviously does a Pam emote because these two are toxic. This Sakura Spike? I respect this Sakura Spike because he doesn't use a single emote and he shot at the tower for being... A, well, just a goof bag. Anyways, when the round's almost over, the tower can do something really stupid. Until now, I'll stop narrating because nothing really, you know, big or anything is going on in my mind at this moment. But to get open that wall, even if I. Because I knew I won't be able to open the full thing. Also, I don't know why that's too good for me. Also, this is where she starts to get extremely toxic. So, hey, look at that. She's even BMing me. She's probably like, oh, there's a spectator on. It's BM. She's probably so stupid, she doesn't even know that if you're a spectator or something. Anyways, they almost lose here, but they, some, they somehow managed to save it. Because at that moment, my beast mode turned off. And the spike scored. But the uh, tower didn't actually do anything, but you know. The music here restarts. I don't know why. I shot at the piper because you don't score that if the wall was open. Definitely, I'm my super. Anyways, here, the Pam tries to be a door. End of stat. And she fails miserably because she didn't even aim it. She just, she just probably went yeet or all the way in or something. Okay, that's it. This is the juiciest part of the whole round. I just kick that. I just kick that thing on and through. Oh, also, look at the trophy amount of blue team. That's the team I'm on. Look at how stupid that is. You know what? I'm going to take a picture of that. Screw that. Screw that to a wall and let's just hope it never comes back. What the heck is 